Hey, hey, welcome back to the channel. Thank you all for joining me on this fitness journey. So today I am doing starting the Chloe Ting, what is it called? Summer Shred. And I'm just showing you what my body looks like before. So it is the holiday season and I thought I'd go ahead and get a head start on my weight loss. Um, so here I am. And I just was showing you my love handles and how those are the worst parts of my body. So it's going to be difficult to get rid of those but you know we're gonna be realistic here so it is morning time and I have not had any food so this is not any bloat this is pure fat and I'm just going to be getting my measurements in centimeters so I'm getting around my waist and I'm gonna get in like the worst part of my of my stomach So the measurement here, this is in centimeters, is around 91.5 centimeters. And now I'm getting my, I don't know what to call this. I guess my, mm, <laughs> my butt, I suppose. I'm trying to get the widest part and that was 108.5 centimeters. And here I am getting my thighs because I just felt like my thighs are really big. But you'd be surprised to see the end result. And the measurement here is 90, whoops, sorry, 62 centimeters. And now I'm going to take you to get weighed. Seven. Mm. Jesus Christ. Well. I don't have a goal. Actually, my actual goal is to literally be consistent. I do like working out, but I just can never keep going without having a challenge to do, so whatever. This challenge is gonna to have to be a challenge. All right, let's get started. <laughs> Those two workouts were so difficult for me. I, I guess I just can't hop right back in. I felt just so weak and so heavy. Like, it's ridiculous. But, you know, day one is complete. 20 more days. And I will update y'all on the beginning of week two and week three. And I give y'all the final results. Hopefully, I get some good results. All right. I'll see y'all soon. Bye. I just got done with day number eight of Chloe Team's workout. And I must say, I definitely feel stronger. I'm able to do the workouts a whole lot better and I'm less sore the next day, especially compared to that second day. And that was a hot mess. Um, so I can definitely tell the progress with the way I'm working out, um, the quality of my moves and just the way I'm looking so far, so far so good. Um, so I just can't wait for y'all to see the ending results. I'm liking what I see. Um, I will come back to you on the beginning of week three and you know, keep y'all updated. Um, it's definitely tip, definitely important to um, stretch before and after your workout to prevent uh, the bulk of the soreness, I do believe. So I'm, I'm gonna stretch right now because I just finished the workout. I might do her little post-workout um, warm down thing. I never really do that, but I'll come back to y'all on week three and yeah, go work out. <laughs>
so today is day number 17 so we're into week three we'll have what four more days left and today is also christmas morning so i'm going to be eating a lot of food today so i'm going to have to work out really hard to, to make up for all that okay i will get, catch y'all back up sorry the workout's about to start i'll catch y'all back up um at the end <laughs> when i'm all done with the full week okay All right, y'all, good morning. It is officially the end of the 21 day challenge and here are my results. This is the next morning, so I haven't eaten anything. So I just wanna show you what I'm looking like. I just wanna make sure that we're all being realistic about results and it's only been three weeks. So um, I think this is pretty good. I can definitely tell a difference, especially the side profile. Y'all remember the first one and let me get the back. So maybe we can see a little reduction in the back fat. Maybe, maybe not. I definitely can, and I know I'm stronger. Um, let me let's flex in a little bit. This is definitely my trouble spot, and my love handles are trouble spot. So, you know, like I said, we're gonna keep going with these uh, challenges, and we are going to make fitness our lifestyle. We're not just gonna do challenges and be done with it. We want to make fitness the lifestyle. So, I'm going to get the measurements. Remember I did it in centimeters and I had got the widest or the worst, the worst part of my stomach. So I think it was about right here. And we are at about, let me show you. I think we're about maybe 86. I'm gonna say 86, we're about right here. Somewhere between there. Whoops, I wish it would like focus. Anyways, that's 86. Next thing I had got was my um, booty. And I didn't really feel like I needed any booty exercises, but I can tell it's more roundness. It's definitely firmer. My thighs are definitely stronger for sure. Like Lord have mercy, the number of lunges, the number of lunges every single day is quite insane. So <laughs> I'm trying to do this fast for y'all so y'all not sitting here like, I'm on the wrong side. Hold on. Look where we at, 107. Is this right? Am I doing this right? Yeah, okay. So that's 107. I'm pretty sure it got bigger. Let me make sure I'm in the right spot. <laughs> All right, I, I'm gonna go with 107. Not too picky about what that number is. And then I did my thigh. So let's kind of bring my thigh up for you. Let me see. Thigh, probably just the widest. Like so much muscle. I feel like I can put on muscle quite fast. So that is at 62. I'm gonna go with 62. Somewhere around there. So we're gonna definitely compare the difference between what I had. And this is me flexing. Can you see those muscles coming in? I had abs. Just underneath all that fat. But anyways, let me get the weight. And y'all gonna be maybe pretty sad, I don't know. But let's always remember that muscle weighs more than fat. And so during this whole process, you're doing a, both, a balance of both losing fat and gaining muscle. So with that being said, alrighty, so here we are. We are at 158.6 or 0.8. Oh, and I do believe, I want to say that I was 157. Y'all correct me if I'm wrong. So I think I did gain a pound, but to be honest, ugh. It's kind of discouraging, but when I know that I really am stronger and I look better 
you know, when I look at myself, the weight on the scale doesn't really matter. So that is a reminder to you. Don't be so obsessed with the number on the scale. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe and check out the next videos I have. And, you know, you gotta subscribe for that because it takes a long time to do these workouts. I know it's probably only 10 minutes for you, but it's been three weeks for me. So I <laughs> see y'all in the next video. And remember, health is wealth. Bye.